Patriot Way Brick Walk is a culmination of, of efforts between the city and the chamber to honor our military with a local landmark. Uh, we discovered that really in our community there was no permanent landmark where our military men and women and their families could be honored and that's how the Patriot Way Brick Walk was born and it allowed for citizens and families to purchase bricks in honor of their military loved one, uh, present, past, uh, family members in a permanent way that generations to come can, can come and see. So for this service project, I basically took pictures of the Patriot Way Brick Walk in columns of seven bricks, which kind of looked like this. After I took a picture of all the bricks, I put each brick into a spreadsheet with the coordinate, the image URL, and the section that it was in. Overall, this project took me about 45 hours by myself, and then including leading others to take the pictures. The finished project is now on the Belton Chamber website under the Living in Belton tab. It's labeled by Patriot Way Brickwalk Interactive Map. You can zoom into the map and see how many bricks are in each section of the Patriot Way Brickwalk. You can even search a name of a specific brick for a picture to pop up. The Eagle Project was a wonderful addition to the Brick Walk Project because we live in a global world, um, global society, and people have purchased bricks all over the world, literally. And the Eagle Scout Project allowed for an online feature that will allow for folks who have bought their bricks to go online and to see their brick, to be able to look it up and be a part of the brick walk even if they don't live close to Belton. They can share it with their family and friends that live overseas, that may be deployed. Um, it's just a way to connect the world with Belton, Texas and the Patriot Way Brick Walk to honor those men and women and their families. I dedicated my project to my great-grandfather, Marion Seibert, and my grandfather, Austin Conley, who had both fought in World War II.